dairy farm of the future, complete with solar-powered robotic milking equipment and other high-efficiency energy-saving equipment. The farm is one of many examples of how the technical colleges are walking the talk by infusing green and sustainable practices into their own operations. We can be that application piece. We can try the things and see how they work in the real life world that we live in and the work environment. Some examples are highly visible. Our turbines are here for two reasons. First reason is, to, is part of our instructional lab, but secondly, they generate generates electricity for our campus, which actually helps us keep our costs down. Other sustainable solutions may be less apparent, but also deliver a big return. Energy efficient lighting has saved more than $100 million, and solar tubes minimize our burden on the energy grid. Technical colleges continually strive to reduce the amount of waste they produce through recycling and reuse. Landfills really need to be a thing of the past. A lot of the materials that go into our landfills could be used to be making biofuels. We used to pay to get rid of the fryer grease from our cafeteria operation. 100% of that fryer grease now comes to our biofuels lab for made into biodiesel. The walking the talk. Now it's on biodiesel fuel. And it's Other college programs use that biodiesel in tractors and machinery. Fossil fuels aren't going to be around forever. We need to conserve what we have. Even truck driving programs cut fuel costs and carbon emissions by reconfiguring the number of driving days. In fact, the technical colleges serve as functional sustainability labs. This is serving All programs involve students in sustainable practices. Uh, that's what makes this work. We maintain our campus. We're going to grow somewhere between 40 and 50,000 plants in those houses. We don't have to transport much in and out of here. Once we start growing it, it's right here. So that helps in the reduction of fossil fuels. Hey, how's it going? Good. Student groups organize around green goals. That helps the colleges achieve additional sustainability. There's just not that many schools in the country that are even really doing this. So I wanted to jump on board, not only to do something better for myself, but better for the community and for the world. Those practices include encouraging the use of reusable mugs and biodegradable utensils in college cafeterias paperless hand dryers, and filtered water stations around campus. The technical colleges also show their commitment to sustainability in the facilities they build. When we remodel anything in our college, the students come in and are part of that redesign process. Planners of new campus facilities strive for LEED certification using energy efficient and sustainable products like this floor made of recycled materials. It's just one more way Wisconsin's technical colleges are integrating green practices into everyday living and learning.